The idea of cooking the asparagus on a plancha, you get a straight heat because it's flat. You can put a pyrex on it. The butter is hot, you can see the smoke. You will cook the asparagus, you get all the flavor of it. You have no risk to lose any flavor, overcook them. You can overcook them, but you get a better control. Most of the people will cook it sometimes in water or will grill it. Grill it is as, is as good as this, but sometimes if you cook it in water, you lose the flavor. I find the water, if you taste the water after you've been cooking the asparagus, the flavor is, in, is there. And if, where are you going? In the sink. Donc, by cooking it in a butter, you keep the full flavor. And you see the butter is rubbing the asparagus. Donc, it makes like a coat. And you can keep all the flavor of the asparagus inside of it without losing any flavor. The other benefits to cook them like this is you keep the chlorophyll of the asparagus. And you will think, oh, it's cooked low temperature, the vegetable will be gray at the end. But it will go gray if you overcook it but the chlorophyll will stay inside. And the chlorophyll is actually the flavor you find in your water when you, when you blanch it. But the plancha gives the same idea of temperature, with low temperature, but you can actually as, as well cook a piece of fish on it, a piece of meat, which has got multi-use. What's great about using appliance like this, where you know the temperature is not going to move, it's like a confidence, you know? It's like you can you trust your instances. You know you can turn your back, you put it at the temperature, you can do something else, you can come back, bang, it didn't move. Alors que sometimes, if you try to do it on a gaz, it will be a perfect temperature for a moment. And soon you stand still, it starts going hotter. Alors this, if it stay if for 180, soon it go over, over 180, kill himself off. And that's the beauty about it. Okay, and this way, for me, is the best way to cook the asparagus.